Good morning, sir. Hey, boss, you want the usual, the tuna on the rye? Sure. Get some chow. Go ahead, it's my dollar. No, thank you, sir. I ate. Fine, don't. It's nice here. May I read my paper, please? I'm sorry, sir. I'll get some food. No, you won't. You fucked that up. Now, please, I'm reading. Shut up. Where's the officer? Back at the division? Gonna be nice not roasting all summer in a hot black and white. Tell me a story, Hoyt. My story? Not your story. A story. You won't shut up long enough to let me read my paper, so tell me a story. I don't think I know any stories. This is a newspaper. And I know it's 99% bullshit, but it's entertaining. It entertains me, that's why I read it. If you won't let me finish my paper, then entertain me with your bullshit. Tell me a story. A real one, or should I make it up? Where'd you do your probation? Van Nuys. Right, the valley. Mm -hmm. No cute little anecdotes about uh, the mean streets of Van Nuys? Writing underage smoking sites at the shopping mall? There was this one DUI stop. A DUI stop? Wow, go on. Uh, we were on the mid-watch. We, you and? Debbie. Debbie. Who fucks Debbie? My training officer, Debbie Maxwell. Your TO's a female? Yes, sir. She white or black? She's white. She all diked out or she any good? <laughs> She's pretty good. <laughs> all right, so you and Debbie, you're on mid-watch. Right, it's a real quiet night, uh, a yawner. We're rolling on Vanowin and I'm driving in this Acura, just this beautiful car comes out of Side Street in excess all over the median. So I light it up and hit the whaler. Guy drives on like I'm invisible for 10 blocks before he pulls over. Ran plates, I approach Debbie Covers. Driver's this huge white guy, could barely keep his eyes open. I field test and arrest and I'm buckling him in the back of the unit. Debbie's tossing his car and she calls me over and shows me a snub 38 and two shotguns loaded and locked. No shit. No shit. She calls her supervisor and I keep searching and I find 500 grams of meth in the dash. Turns out our DUI was on bail for distribution. He was on his way to smoke his ex-partner before trial. <laughs> he prevented a murder. He prevented a murder. Amazing. You spent a whole year with a fine bitch in your car, and the most entertaining story you got for me is a DUI stop? You never hit her up for a Codex in the back seat? I have a wife. You also have a dick. Bam. Where's the tip? I'm oh, sorry, sir. It's a dollar seventy-five. <laughs>